Hello and welcome back to the channel and now you join me for this week's Forzathon guide called American Muscle which wants you to own and drive either the 1995 Chevrolet Corvette ZR1 or the 2009 Chevrolet Corvette ZR1. So without further ado let's get stuck in. Now I opted for the 2009 Chevrolet Corvette ZR1, uh, it set you back 125,000 credits from the auto show but of course if you have the other one the 95 you can use that too and I haven't created a tune either. Now the first challenge here simply wants you to earn three stars at speed traps in either of the Corvettes. So the speed trap I chose for this was the Paso Inferior. Now you don't have to get three stars in one run, but it does make life a bit easier. Now I know what you're thinking, rear wheel drive V8 muscle car um, on a sort of dirt speed trap. It's probably not the easiest thing, but if you have the straight run up, it is pretty easy. And it's got a very low three star score. So smashing 105 mile an hour is super easy to do. And that's the first challenge. Now the next one here simply wants you to paint the body of the car, so we all know how to do that. Go into your main hub, into your garage, and then colours and paints, uh, or designs and paints, sorry. Pick whichever colour you want, doesn't have to be a manufacturer. Select it, come out, and that'll be the second challenge complete. Now the third and final challenge here simply wants you to win a road race, which again is super easy to do. So to do this, I re recommend heading over to the Arch of Mulehay Circuit, where I have a race set up for you. The share code is there on your screen. It's called Forzathon Easy, and it's one lap with no AI driver tars. So of course, you are guaranteed a win every single time, but you only have to win it once, and that will be the final challenge of this week's Forzathon Complete. Now, hopefully this guide has helped you out. If it has, I'd very much appreciate if you could drop a like. But of course, if you're struggling with anything, then please do let me know down below in the comments. I would be more than happy to help you guys out. If it did help though, and you're new to the channel, I'd very much appreciate if you could subscribe as well. But apart from that, folks, don't forget to stick around for this week's photo challenge guide coming shortly after this. But I hope this video did help. Like I said, I want to thank you very much for watching. Make sure you stay safe and take care.